Hello souls, how are you? It's time for another miraculous reading. Today we'll make another true crime case reading. And I have to make disclaimer that all the information in this reading is alleged and for entertainment purposes only. The case I choose for today is the Shankwara Robinson's case. As I was really shocked by it and I wanted to know what really happened in Kabul, what was the motive for all this and for me personally it doesn't make sense so I wanted to see what the card will tell me, how they will show this case and probably if uh, we could see what actually happened. So let's start with the overall view. How the card will show what happened in Cabo. Magician. Devil. Knight of Swords, Queen of Pentacles, and Two of Swords. So, Magician with Devil is not really good combination. It talks about manipulation. It talks about somebody who is not showing their their real face we already know that for sure and somebody who get angry to Shankwela I believe this card represents her as she is the Queen of Pentacles this is an abundant woman who knows how to earn money Somebody who knows how to take care of everybody around her. So, this is not shown as group energy. This is the overall energy. It's not specific person. It's not uh, also the group energy. But this is the dynamic of the events. So, there was somebody who was trying to manipulate Shankwela. And they were trying to make her submissive somehow, to control her. And uh, they get angry at her as she said, no, I won't obey. Okay, was everything planned or... It was just some situation that went out of control. Before they went to this trip, were they planning all of this? And by all of this, I mean uh, what we saw on the video clips. I don't mean the ending. Were they planning? To go in this direction. We have six of pentacles, pentacles, two of wands, wheel of fortune, six of swords, and king of swords. No, it was not planned. At least the cards are uh, showing that. They were thinking about good spending time, uh, spending money, spending their time and uh, taking advantage of this offer. They were, they were looking for this trip. Maybe it was planned for months. I don't have information about the planning of this trip. So once they went there, 
this is the moment when they decided to take action in that direction this is when they start planning it only after they went there not prior so what make them think in that direction what was actually that make them think start thinking in that direction to start planning making this I don't know how to describe videos, these dump videos and attacks. What makes them start planning this whole thing? So there was something like uh, in the background with the world card, there's something that was building up, but it was really sudden. And uh, once they went there, it became like too much. And it was fast decision. It didn't took uh, so much time for them. They didn't think, they didn't consider anything. They were like uh, blindfolded of rage and acting stupid as fools. They even um, enjoyed their uh, range. Okay. So, what was the specific situation that made them so upset, angry? What was the specific situation? Okay, two of cups, eight of cups, ten of wands. Judgment, Knight of Wands, I will uh, say what I see on the cards and what not what I want, what I know for about this case. I will tell you what I see because sometimes um, the information does not match what we know but we'll see eventually if this is the true case if this is the case in this uh, situation so there was some sort of flirt with somebody of the guys with some of the guys with Shanquela and she walked away And uh, this guy felt the rejection as something really heavy and uh, he couldn't tolerate it. So he decides to call out also the others to somehow He called the other uh, guys and tried to manipulate them, obviously successfully, and make them act. He said that this is something that they have to do urgently. It's now or never something of this uh, sort. So, oh. 
I asked, uh, was this a love situation? Just asking for another confirmation. And yes, it was uh, some sort of uh, love triangle, third party. Somebody was jealous. Somebody couldn't uh, help, help hold the rejection. And this was the reason. It was not only money. Uh, I thought that it was all financial, but there's jealousy here. Somebody was rejected and couldn't hold it. Couldn't hold it. <laughs> Sorry for my language. For my English. So, was the final the person who was responsible for the final result was a female or a male knight of cups we have a male and queen of swords so this uh, guy younger guy the younger uh, maybe the, the youngest in the group he pushed the Queen of Swords. Maybe they were in a relationship. This um, woman was uh, more heartless. She's not that emotional. And this guy knew exactly what he was doing. That she would be like with no, no mercy. She was uh, manipulated by this guy and uh, he already cheated on her in the past. We see this situation when he acted like King of Wands with the High Priestess next to him. So she was not that uh, emotionally involved with this guy anymore like in the past but uh, once they were in love they were more like a couple in the past he cheated on her so he pushed her pushed her but buttons and made her act so it was a woman so this is true that we know will be um, this person, will this person go to jail? Will there be justice in this case? Will there be justice? Here, um, the cards are saying that it's not the justice we expect. Most probably there won't be the result we, we all want to see. It will be justice from the higher forces. Uh, she will have to make really hard work but it's uh, not on a, on the earth plane level her soul will be punished somehow for this this is a really strange message The problem is that there are two uh, forces here. So uh, if you think about like the Mexican police and the US police, there are two forces who are taking care of this case also here. 
and they have to uh, learn how to work together side by side there shouldn't be somebody of them to want to lead the investigation or some sort making the leading force they should work side by side but they don't want to both sides don't both sides don't want to work together so uh, with time the spirit guides could in take intervention and make them work together but it will take a really long time and uh, during that time the only punishment will be from spiritual point of view were the mexican authorities acting not as they should have Did they make something intentionally bad? Not as they should have. What I see here is that uh, just the place uh, and the location was not the usual place for violence and this is the reason that they got confused and that they didn't expect it to deal with a situation like this you see that the cards are showing really cheerful situation and uh, they were told also that it was problem with drinking and alcohol that, that it was nothing serious somebody told them intentionally the wrong information so they didn't act uh, they didn't have the correct information and uh, it was not intentionally it was not intentional on their side what they did just they got the wrong information and uh, one last line of information did Shanquela herself want to tell us something did she want to talk with us to have the king of pentacles so oh, yes what is her message? She says, I was successful. I have wonderful family. I was the beloved child I shine I was strong and I rest in peace I was victorious I had the most beautiful family I was shining I felt loved all my life, I was strong and now I am resting in peace. Very beautiful energy. So that was the reading. I remind you that the information is alleged. If you liked it, give me a like, share and subscribe and I'll see you in the next reading. Bye bye.